Plantagenet Princesses by Douglas Boyd. Um, the Daughters of Eleanor of Aquitaine and Henry II. So, each daughter does get uh, their own chapter, but um, other... Yeah. Um, Eleanor seems to get... Yeah, so the first few chapters are about, like, Eleanor and, like, Henry and, like, information about the family. And then, um, her, like, remarriages, armies, her relationship with other countries. And then you get, um, chapters about their, um, daughters. Um, so, like, Eleanor's ninth pregnancy... And sixth was, um, she, she had like nine, a ninth pregnancy, her sixth with Henry, um, Queen Lenore, po, the Pope interactions, um, so it's an intro to what happened around her, like, to me it's more of like, the common threat is Eleanor with some information about her daughters and their interactions with, like, France and England and, um, Europe in general. Um, so people, two people and a few things around her, um, our armies, Louis the Ninth, um, you do get a few family trees um, that um, tell you everything. Um, states. And then you get like maps like that. Um, showing what. Um, so that's of her inheritance. So. Henry um, contented himself while traveling with gruel or bread and expected his companions to do the same. Um, like you get photographs. And primary images. Um, so, like, to me, there is information about the, their daughters, but to me, it's more of a different type of biography of Eleanor, because to me, that is the main focus of this book. There are mentions of her kids, um, her kids with Henry, and then, like, a few of the ones that she's had before, um, that have lived to adulthood. Um, yeah, so, if you do have an interest in Eleanor and wanting a little bit of information about her kids, you do get a bit of, um, information about them and their interactions. Um, on their own. <coughs> so like their marriages and interactions with um like in polit in politics, religion or or whatever. Um so yeah, um Planet Princesses by Douglas Boyd. Happy readings.